HHS and welcome back to another episode of HHS Today. I'm your host James Muzzy. Today we'll have a very fun episode. On Thursday, meaning tonight, it's the opening of the Radium Girls by HHS Drama. Make an effort to see it on either Thursday, Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. You have no excuse. Our first segment today has Haley bringing us highlights from the boys' basketball game in her segment, Play of the Game. Hi, this is Haley Oslander reporting from the boys' varsity playoff game versus Wayland. We're going to be using some footage while we look for the Play of the Game, and we're also going to check out what HCAM is up to. <laughs> Trying to get it over to Nurse, it's stolen by Lynn, good feed over to Puvacad, good pump fake, off the window and in! What a great effort by the Hillers basketball team. The hard work this season really showed. Guess what? Tomorrow's a Hiller day. And that means Diversity Club is supplying cultured foods in the cafeteria, first thing. And it could literally be anything. Yum! Now in our social media segment, we have Lulu Murphy discussing an awesome website called Red Bubble. Hi, I'm Lou Murphy and I'm going to be talking about the website Redbubble. Redbubble has awesome products from designed by independent artists. One of my favorite products that Redbubble offers is their stickers. The stickers are great for putting on your computer in case you want your case to be personalized. I have three computer cases here that have stickers from Redbubble. So the owner of this case probably likes to show friends because of this sticker from Redbubble. And the owner of this case probably likes to play Mario Kart. And lastly, the owner of this case probably vacations in Hawaii a lot. Redbubble is for everyone. Jeez, too many stickers to count. I literally can't even count that high. You can do it, James. Okay. Anyways, I better start saving up so my computer can look that cool. Next up, we have Grace and Lexi with the question of the day. Or actually, are you smarter than a fifth grader? New York City. No. Is that New York City? No. Yeah. Oh. Albany. Albany. Africa, Antarctica, Asia, North America, Europe. South America, Australia. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Legislative. Judicial. Executive. Executive. Judicial. Yeah. Is that all? That's three. three. Judicial. Executive. <laughs> Legislative. <laughs> Pound of feathers. They're the same. They're the same, same weight. Thing. They are the same weight. Uh, Atlantic Ocean, Pacific Ocean, Indian Ocean, Arctic Ocean. Um, the Atlantic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, the Indian Ocean, the Arctic Ocean. That fifth one's going to get me. Okay, who knew fifth graders could be so smart? I'm definitely not smarter than a fifth grader. You can do it, James. Thank you. All right. Let's move on with our interview segment where Morgan interviews Mrs. Giano about the recent art awards. The Scholastic Art Awards is a national art competition, um, but at first it's done locally, so it's done at the state level in Massachusetts for all high school students and middle school students age 13 and up. We had 16 works that won, one gold key, six silver keys, and 10 honorable mentions. We had a variety of winning works. Some were um, drawing and illustration, some were industrial design related. So we send off over 120 submissions every year, and you just never know. Um, based on what the judges' aesthetics are, who's going to win. It's a pool of probably over like 15,000 entries in just the state. So it, it is always exciting when we get silver and gold key winners. Gold key works are on display and then gold key works get to go off to the national level too. 
That was pretty cool. We have some talented classmates. Oh, and have you seen this? This is somewhere in HHS. If you've seen it, email us at hhstv at hillers.org and maybe you'll win a new water bottle. And that sums up all of our segments for the week. Thanks so much for watching today's episode. Make sure you visit our website to watch previous episodes and bloopers. I'm James Mosey and this is HHS TV.